Hello everybody, yes, it is me, the one and only Grail Sutcliffe. I know you've all missed me terribly, and I'm so sorry. I have been busy with work again. I had quite a lot of paperwork to catch up with, and Will was making me do all these errands, and uh, I, I just couldn't say no to that cute little face. Well, I wouldn't call it cute, more stern, and attractive, and dark. Uh, Anyway, you get the idea. So, a little birdie told me that that awful brat, CL Phantom Hive, had some very successful videos where he tried not to laugh. Now, I don't really see that as a challenge for him because he's never laughed in his bloody life. I'm absolutely sick of everyone going on about that brat. So I'm going to steal his thunder and copy him. And because I can do everything better than CL can. I'm going to show you how it's done. I have complete control over my emotions. Utterly. I'm an open book, yes. But when I'm challenged, I can be as quiet as a mouse. I will not laugh. No, not even once. You can choose whether to believe me or not, but I suppose the challenge will speak for itself. So, let's get started then. Right. I don't know what to say, but I didn't laugh. You saw it. Why is he throwing eggs? It's eggs. Yeah, yeah. yeah eggs. Yeah. Like why? Why is he throwing them? He, he likes eggs. Oh. Nothing. See? Oh, look at this Halloween stuff. This is pretty sweet. Kind of spooky. I know I slightly smiled. But that was just because I had something stuck in my teeth. That was it. Millie's my favorite. Look how calm she is as well. This is a nice photograph. Is this elegant lady a member of your family? No, she killed my mother's dog. Sounds like a great lady. Having a drink. Well, I suppose that's life, isn't it? One minute you're alive and drinking water, and the next minute a crocodile jumps out and eats you alive. Just have to accept it, really. That was fantastic aim. I want to see that again. I need to learn some tricks from that man. The entire time I knew him. He only ever had one goal. To wipe out half the universe. Just like that. Tell me his name again. Christopher Robin. <laughs> I can't believe it. No, that's... That doesn't count. I have complete control over myself. Entire control. <sighs> right. That's how you look after children, right? You terrify them. Constantly. Don't you? 
How about them app? Uh, to me. Uh. Well, that was just so many levels of stupid. This is library. <laughs> Quite right. And we are going to be looking at the optimal mathematical way to play Monopoly. <laughs> Actually, last time me and Will played Monopoly, it ended quite like that, so... Relatable. Name a place you see chicks. <laughs> I didn't even understand what was going on there. Sorry, it all happened too fast. <laughs> Is he all right? I'm concerned. What is going on? Nope. Nothing. See? I'm good at this. Actually, I do remember reaping that man. We did sing that song when he died. Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> oh, I mean, that, that wasn't a laugh uh, part of the challenge. That was more me agreeing with the situation and remembering it. One thing I've learned after 21 years, you never know what is going to come through that door. <laughs> There's a lot of things coming through doors. I'm not sure why. Again, I'm not really sure what, what's going on, but I'm rolling with it. This season, we're asking six big questions. On this episode, how smart are animals? No. Ah, I feel good. I knew that I wouldn't. I'm running for president. It's going over my head. No idea who that is. He's very passionate, isn't he? And he's very big. Is he really that big in real life? How do you house him? How much does he eat? <laughs> that was quite skilled, actually. What you want me to do with this? Eat it! Happy birthday to the crowd! Oh wow! 
It's a man shellfish. Never seen one in the wild before. Is that a real animal? Oh my gosh! What? Look at that! What? Hand. Put my hand in there? Yeah. All right. I, I wouldn't recommend doing that. It doesn't look like the right thing to do to put your hand in. I don't know what that was. I always wear gloves. But even I wouldn't do that. See this? Melbourne, Daytona Beach, all the way up to Jacksonville. This moves 20 miles to the west, and you and everyone you know are dead. All of you. Because you can't survive it. It's not possible, unless you're very, very lucky. And your kids die, too. I mean, he's telling it as it is. I think I would probably do the same. I don't really see what the issue is there. Really? So... Sounds like a good well man, really. I'm going to ask some questions of our crowd here. Uh, sir, tell me, uh, do you believe in ghosts? No, but I know who to call if there are. Is that right? Yeah. And, and who would that be? Ghostbusters. Oh, very funny. Okay. Actually, no, I wouldn't call it Ghostbusters. I tried them before. They didn't really understand the concept of Reapers and how we weren't bad, but we were also not alive. Just don't bring the Ghostbusters up. It's a touchy subject. It's a fancy car. This music again. Well, that's unfortunate. That was very charming, really. Don't see why it's meant to be funny. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh God! Oh, you can't get <laughs> Kevin, don't, Kevin, 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 watch the light, dude. Well, Kevin is clearly stupid. That's all I can say. Instead of hearing music, you hear this. I mean, that sounds like the music I listen to. That was amazing! Wow! That's about sneeze. That looks painful. That was painful, I imagine. Oh, man again. The large man in the sky. Oh, he has laser powers. That's very intriguing. Well, that was probably not the strangest thing I've done, but it was rather strange. This was just confirming everything I know about humanity, which is they're stupid. They can't do anything. They have terrible sense of humor. They love watching people get hurt. And I mean, I have to agree with that. It is rather funny watching people get hurt. <laughs> but overall, I am just very confused. But tell me what do you think? And if you want me to come back and do it again, then let me know.
Until next time, darling. Stay fabulous. And I will see you very soon. Mwah. I remember that one. There's multiples in this. There's ones that I've... Not me. I haven't seen before. See, I've seen before. This is more a uh, Can Victor Stay in Character Challenge. Grell requires so much energy. Oh god. Why do I do this again? Did they die? Actually, wait, I can check. Where's my satire list? I need to know the day. I need to know the exact date. Never mind. I'm sure they probably did die. <laughs> Actually, I do remember going and seeing a terrible bear accident with a fancy car. Eh. Of course, that was in the future. And I couldn't possibly have done that because I live in Victorian times, as you know. <laughs> this is a Victor trying to stay in character challenge, isn't it? I had to tie my camera to the tripod because it keeps falling over. Because they haven't designed tripods for this kind of camera yet. Or maybe they have. I just haven't found them. It's so weird how I can't really... Wait, I'm trying to talk in my normal voice now. What is my normal voice? Hello. Hello. Anyway, on with the show. I oh, know I'm doing now. <sighs> Finally, see the teeth out. My God, I made these in 2015. I'm still using them, and they're sore. They're made of glue and fake nails. But that's what budget cosplay is, my friends. Thank you.